Hello. Hi, teacher. Hi, Rosa. How are you today? Hi, uh, teacher. Very good. How was your day at work? Mm, so tired because if we have a meeting all day. Wow. All day in meeting? Yes. Wow. <laughs> That's tired. Yeah, I understand. And it's stressful, I suppose. Uh, yes, yes, it's stressful. But it was uh, in a hotel. Ah, that's nice. Uh -huh. Sounds better. <laughs> the, the food. <laughs> ah, you got food. Wow. Uh -huh. The coffee break. Uh -huh. coffee ah, okay. Break. So that's not very, very, very yeah. bad, completely bad. Okay, that's nice. What about the rest of you? How are you doing, Roxana? How was your day? Hello, Roxana. How was your day? Okay. Well, um, I'd like to know how are you doing with the platform? Como van con la plataforma? Um, some exercise. Some exercise missing. I think that today we finished yes. the section four. Creía que ahora vamos a terminar la sección cuatro. Solo queda una sección más. Tienen que estar al día. Me imagino que ya hicieron el midterm exam, el que está al final de la sección tres. Yes. Okay, that's good. That's important. Okay. Um, what, um, well, today we're going to study uh, some vocabulary about summer activities. You have that vocabulary in the platform. Um, can you mention some activities that you can do on summer or on vacation? Go to the beach. Go to the beach. Uh huh. Um, go visit, visit places. Uh, visit different places. Uh, visit new places. Uh, uh, travel, probably. Travel. Uh huh. A, a cup of coffee with family and tamales. Coffee with family. Traditional uh, yes. food with family. Uh huh. What other activities can you do? Uh, clean the house. Fix oh, the clean the house. house. Fix the Fix car. The car. Mm. Okay. That's it. Let's have some more vocabulary here. We have uh, this vocabulary about summer activities. Um, there are two words that go with each bird in the chart. Let's take a look to the verbs. Let's repeat. Get. Get. Go. 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 Have. Have. Uh, have. Meet. 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 Play. 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 Take. 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 Okay, those verbs go with some expressions or activities here. Let's repeat camping. Camping. A class. A class. Fun. 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 A job. A job. A new bike. A new bike. New people. New, New people. people. Old friends. Old friends. A picnic. A picnic. Softball. 
Softball. Swimming pool. Swimming pool. A trip. A trip. A trip. Volleyball. Volleyball. Okay, in this list, there are two of these activities that can go with these verbs. Okay, for example, get. get we can say job. get a job. Like this, get a job. Oh, get a new bike. Get a job, get a new bike. In your notebook, try to complete the chart. Two words from this list that go with these verbs. Okay. I give you three minutes. Go camping. Uh huh. Do it in your notebook. Okay. And then we're going to check. Mm. Ya te vas a morir. Have you finished? Yes. <clears throat> Okay, let's check your answers. We have get a job. A what? Uh, which one goes with the verb go? Meet. Go. Volunteer. Go camping. Go camping and. And go a picnic. Mm. Okay, go camping. Mm -hmm. Swim. And go swimming. Uh huh. Go camping. Go swimming. Now have. Which one goes with have? Have a, a class. Have camping. Have picnic. Picnic. Mm. No. Have a no. class. Let's see. Have fun and have a picnic have fun. have fun and have a picnic when you say have fun esa expresión have fun significa divertirse uh -huh. have fun mm -hmm. Now, what about meat? What do you have with meat? Meet new people. Meet new people. Another? Meet old friend. Yes, that's the answer. Meet new people and meet old friends. Play. Which ones go with play? Soccer. Volleyball. Play? 
Softball. Okay, play softball, play volleyball. Okay. Now take. Take. A class. Take a class and? A trip. A trip. Take a class. Take a trip. <coughs> Now, let's ask question using this vocabulary. Uh, Gustavo, did you take a class last summer? Did you take a class last summer? Yes. Yes, I did. Yes, I did. Uh-huh. I yes, took, I did. They, you can say I took English classes, for example. Uh, okay, I took English classes. Okay. Can you ask a question to another classmate? We have Jesus, Andrea, Luis, oh. Pedro, Jocelyn, Carlos, Monica. Okay. Um, Uh -huh. uh, Pedro, did you did you take a camping uh, uh, last summer? Did you take camping or did you go camping? Did you go camping last summer? Uh huh. Did you go camping last summer, Pedro? Last summer, yes, I did. Mm -hmm. Yes, you I can did. give more details. Like for example, I went. Camping to Las Palmas. Ah, okay. Or I uh, went camping um, El Boquerón. I don't know. Okay. I went camping to the Boquerón. Okay, good. Continue, Pedro. Ask a question to another class. Okay. Luis Guardado. Yes. Did you? Okay. Did Mm. Did you did you have I have fun I have fun last summer? Excuse me. Did you have fun a last mm -hmm. summer? I don't know. I am. Um, have fun. ¿Qué dijimos que es have fun? Ah, divertirse. Yes. Uh huh. Did you have fun last summer? Yes, I did. Okay, continue. Um, the last uh, weekend, um, I have a party. Oh, you had a party and you had fun. <laughs> okay, excellent. Ask a question to another classmate. Um, Okay, okay, okay. And the class. Uh, Rosa Portillo. Hi. Did you, um, did you, did you go uh, a trip uh, last summer? Last summer, um, summer is verano, teacher. Yes. Last summer, mm, yes, I did. Okay, continue. Ask another classmate. Uh, Gustavo. Uh, did you did you swimming swimming last weekend? Did you go swimming? Did you go swimming last week? The next yes. week? Yes, I did. I swimming last uh, last I week. I went. I went. I went. I I I went swimming last week. 
in the university. Okay, very good. Um, so, Carlos, did, did you visit family last summer? Yes, I did visit my family last summer. Okay, nice job. So we can continue now to practice a little in the simple past. We can go to the reading. This reading is basically the same that we have in the platform. We're going to practice and try to retain some details in our memory. Um, let's see the topic. Did you have a good weekend? Did you have a good weekend? Did you have a, you good, have a good weekend? weekend? <laughs> Uh huh. Did you have a good weekend? Did you have Did a good weekend? Did you have a good weekend? Okay. Now let's read about Karen. Let's remember Karen. I volunteer to read about Karen. Andrea. Okay, Andrea. I had a great weekend. I went to my best friend Mariela's wedding. She was married in her art garden. She wore a fantastic dress. Her parents served a nice meal after the ceremony. I'm really happy for her. And her new husband is really nice. Okay, very good. Now, this is pronounced her. 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 Okay, very good. Thank you so much. I volunteer to read about Pete. Me, Rosie. Okay, Rosie. I didn't go outside all weekend. I had so much work to do. On Saturday, I studied. I studied. I studied all day. On Sunday, I did the dishes. Cleaned my parent my apartment and did laundry. Sunday night, I watch a DVD for my story class. My weekend wasn't relaxing at all. Okay, good. Thank you so much. Now let's read about Lacey. Volunteer. Me, Monica. Okay, Monica. I had an interesting weekend. I went camping for the first time. My friends and I drove to the camp campsite on Saturday. First, we put up the sand. Then we built a fire, cooked diner and told stories. On Sunday, we went fishing. I didn't really like camping, but are learning a lot. Okay, now, here it's, uh, I heard when the, cuando hay una SH aquí como acá, es el sonido es shh, como que usted está silenciando a alguien. Shh. Dishes. 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 Okay, otro fishing. 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 Ajá, fishing. Fishing. Ajá, como sh, no con che como de chino, es con sh. Fishing. Fishing. Fishing, fishing and dishes. Dishes. Fishing. Dishes. Okay, thank you so much. That's it. Now, a volunteer to read about Jonathan. Luis Guardado. Okay, Luis. I went to a rock concert with some friends. I had an unfull time. It took three hours to drive there. I didn't 
like to band at all. Then on our way home, the car broke, broke down. My parents came and got used. I finally got to home at six in the morning. I am so tired. Okay, good. Thank you so much. Now, let's try to answer these questions. Vamos a leerlo otra vez. Se los voy a dejar ahí dos minutos para que lo lean. Y luego vamos a contestar las preguntas, a ver qué recordamos de la lectura. Ready? Ready. Ready. Okay. Now, let's see what you remember. Read the chat room post and then correct the sentences. For example, number one, it says Karen got married. En la uno nos dice que Karen se casó, pero según el post, Karen's best friend got married. Mm -hmm. Do you remember what happened after the wedding? It says after the wedding, everyone went out to eat. In the garden. Mm -hmm. You have to correct it. Tienen que escribir la información correcta. Según el post. Let's see. Number two, it says after the wedding, everyone went out to eat. Dice que todos fueron a comer. Uh, salieron fuera a comer. After the wedding, Mariela's parents serve a meal. Mm -hmm. De acuerdo con la lectura, los padres de Mariela sirvieron la comida. La comida. Ajá. Mm -hmm. Number three, four, five, six, and seven. Try to do it. Peter, this is your, your apartment. And let's see, we're going to check later. Teacher, en la tres eh, dice que, que Peter estudió todo el todo el, todo el uh -huh. sábado. Todo el día, el domingo. Pero, uh, eh, Peter not studied all day um, Sunday. Peter not or Peter didn't? Peter didn't uh, study on, on Sunday. Peter mm -hmm. uh, study on Saturday. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. he study. Uh, okay. 
um, all day Saturday. Uh -huh. All day Saturday. Let's see, number three. Yes, Pete studied all day on Saturday, not Sunday. It was Saturday. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. That's the correct information. Uh, what about the rest? What about number four? It says he watched TV on Saturday night. What is the correct information? No, he... Sunday night. He, he dried it. Let's see. Watch the Sunday ah, night. Ah, DVDs. He watched a DVD for his history class Sunday night. Okay, Lacey went camping for the third time. What is the correct information? No, it's first, first time. First time, okay, that is the answer. Lacey went camping for the first time. Mm -hmm. Lacey liked camping a lot. No, with friends. It says Lacey liked okay. camping a lot. A lot. A lot. Oh, in... Mucho. Mm -hmm. Mucho. What is the correct information? Let's check. Ah, Lacey didn't really like camping. Now, Jonathan went to a rock concert with his parents. What is Not. the correct information? Oh. Jonathan oh, went to a room. With her friends. Friends. When, friends. With his with friends. Some friends. With his, uh-huh, with some friends. Uh-huh. It took three hours to get home after the concert. Mm -hmm. Is it correct? Okay. Let's check. To it's drive. Correct. To drive dirt. Uh -huh. It took three hours to drive to dirt. Drive dirt. Okay. So with this reading, we've basically finished the section. Or it's just to practice. Um, Esta lectura ya es lo último de la sección 4. Ya lo que queda de hacer acá es practicar. Recuerden que la sección 4 es sobre el pasado simple. And uh, yesterday we said that we need to practice more the simple past. Necesitamos hacer un repaso. Para ese repaso es aquí. Ok, para ese repaso vamos a hacer un ejercicio. Acá está. Ok, este ejercicio es Remember Simple Past. Es lo que hemos estado estudiando, pasado simple. What you have here, lo que ven acá son oraciones en presente, oraciones y preguntas. Ustedes la van a convertir a pasado. Por ejemplo, tenemos la primera. It says, um, la primera. Dice, he goes to bed early. Él va a la cama temprano. Para convertirla a pasado y decir, él fue, 
él fue a su dormitorio o él fue a la cama temprano, sería he went to bed early. Estoy haciendo una oración afirmativa y dijimos que en las afirmativas, en pasado simple, vamos a ir conjugando el verbo. Go, change to, went. went. Ahora, we don't like onions. Ahí recordamos que para hacer oraciones negativas usamos el auxiliar didn't y no conjugamos el verbo. Entonces escribimos la misma oración, solo que en pasado. We didn't like onions. Y así van a ir haciendo el resto en su cuaderno. Si gustan, solo vayan haciendo la, la respuesta en pasado para que no copien presente y después pasado porque perderíamos mucho tiempo. Solo vayan haciéndolas en pasado. Igual esta hojita se las voy a mandar al grupo. So, you will have the complete thing. Finish.
Okay, have you finished? Yes. Has everybody finished? Monica, Jesus, Andrea, Carlos, Roxana? Yes. 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 Okay, now let us check your answers. The following thing uh, is to check your answers. Van a revisar sus respuestas y vamos a ver en cuáles nos equivocamos. Esperemos que en ninguna, pero si sucedió, vamos a ver qué pasó. Ok. La 1 y la 2 eran las que ya teníamos hechas. It says, he went to bed early. We didn't like onions. Number three, to work. Lived in Vancouver. Okay. Did, Did she exercise? I hated cooking. I hated cooking. They played video games. He knew the answer. I forgot his name. They didn't study history. Did they Did drive? He... Jenny worked at a hotel. Did you swim? We didn't like the movie. Where did you live? He drink, he didn't drink tea. They started class at eight. Did he eat breakfast? I didn't run fast. He had a car. Did you enjoy sports? Were your answers correct? Correct. All correct. Yes. Great. Excellent. What about the rest of you? Were your answers correct? Eight. Yes. Those were correct. Eight. Eight Excuse correct. Me. Eighteen. 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 Ah, that's okay. Mm. ¿En cuáles se equivocó? Uh, la última no supe y en la penúltima hay... Uh, I didn't run. No sé. uh, las dos últimas, es que las dos últimas no las. No, no, no sé. He had a car. ¿Usted qué había uh -huh. puesto? No, 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 no supe cómo. Ah, no las tenía, hizo. Tenía, tenía la duda porque eh, si ponía en pasado has, entonces yo decía que has tiene pasado o algo así. Ah, ok, no recordaba ah. el pasado de have. Ajá, ajá. Ah, el pasado es have ajá. con D. Y la última, ajá. la número 20, no la miraba porque estaba como una bandita negra y eso es lo único. Oh. <risa> ok, and the rest of you, Andrea. And... I, for, I forgot, no remember the past, the forget. Ah, no se acordaba del pasado de forget, es forgot. Yes. Hoy uh -huh. creo que no se le va a olvidar. <laughs> a veces así se aprende como que se quedan más las cosas, ¿verdad? Después cuando, ah, era ese. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Caso eh, en la cuatro. Casi... Exercise. Eh, yo puse did do. Si es, yo lo utilicé como que si era un auxiliar. Did y le puso do. Did y do. Entonces, Ajá, lo utilizó como auxiliar y verbo, lo repitió. Es correcto. Ah, ok. Sí. En este caso, es como lo puso el verbo. ¿Mm? En este caso, exercise es la función como de verbo. Exercise es el verbo, sí. Ah, okay. uh, did she do exercise? What did she exercise is the, the appropriate answer. Y así todas las que tenían, iniciaban con interrogante do. Pero ya viendo la respuesta ya yo vi que. Ah, ok, perfecto, eso es bueno. Ok, han hecho un muy, muy buen trabajo con esta parte del pasado. So, vamos a practicar un poco más porque, bueno, mañana es jueves.
Mañana vamos a ver la unidad, bueno, la, la sección 5 ya. Y en la sección 5 vamos a ver la otra parte del pasado, que es el pasado con el verbo to be. Es diferente. A veces ahí se confunde, pero bueno, espero que así como han trabajado bien en esta parte, muy bien, excelente, los felicito. Espero que así hagan lo demás. Vamos a ver mañana. Okay. Uh, there you can see a set of sentences. What you have to do is to organize them in the correct sequence. We have, uh, I went to the park with my friends. Then we had a delicious picnic lunch. I had a great weekend. We played soccer until noon and then we walked home. What is the correct order? What do you think is the correct order? I had a great week weekend. So for you, I had a great weekend is the first. Uh -huh. I, went, I went to the park. Uh, uh -huh. uh, walk. I went to the park with my friends. Uh, and we we play we we soccer until noon. Then we have delicious picnic lunch, and then we walk we walk we walk home. It's correct. It, it's correct. Okay, let me check. Ah, two of them are incorrect. Ajá, uh -huh. it says we played soccer until noon. Es que jugamos hasta mediodía y bueno, después de mediodía se almuerza, ¿verdad? Ajá, mm. uh -huh. but that's pretty good. That's good job. Now, let's see another exercise. Uh, we also practice Yes, no questions yesterday. So we have these short conversations that we have to complete with the words that we have in these little boxes. There is one extra word. It means that you're not going to use them all. We have liked, take, took, did, and like. Did Jonathan piano lesson? Take. 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 Okay. No, he didn't. He didn't take it. Talk. He took. Guitar lesson. Like it. Like it. He like he like it. It. I like it a lot. I like it a lot. Okay, very nice. Great job. Let's repeat. Did Jonathan take play piano lessons this summer? Did Jonathan take, Jonathan take piano, piano lessons this summer? No, he didn't. He took guitar lessons. No, he no, didn't. He didn't. He guitar lessons. Guitar lessons. Did he like it? Did, did he, he like, like it? it? Yes, he did. He liked it a lot. Yes, yes he, did. he did. He liked, he liked, it, liked it, a it a lot. Next. Remember that there is one extra word. I clean the house. I clean. I clean. Clean it. Mm. 
Did you clean the laundry too? Did you? Did you too? Ajá, cuando hacemos la lavada, digamos, en, is do, do the laundry. Mm -hmm. Yes, I do. I clean. I clean the laundry. I clean the laundry on Sunday. I clean the laundry on Sunday. No puedo decir que limpié la lavada. I did. Ajá, hice, hice la lavada. I did. I did the laundry on Sunday. Let's check. That's correct. Okay, let's repeat one more time. Did you go out last weekend? Did you go out last weekend? No, I didn't. I cleaned the house. No, I didn't. I didn't clean the house. Did you do the laundry too? Did you do the laundry too? The laundry too? Yes, I did. I did the laundry on Sunday. Yes, I did. Yes, I did. Laundry on Sunday. Okay. Next. Go. 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 Go on vacation in the summer. Yes, I did. Then went, when, 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 go when, 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 No, when, 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 go on vacation last summer? Yes, they did. They went camping. Yes, yes they, they did. did. They, they went, went camping. camping. Did they go whitewater rafting? Did they go whitewater rafting? No, they didn't. They went hiking. No, no they, they didn't. didn't. They, they went, went, went hiking. hiking. Okay, nice. The last one. Do you have a good weekend? Yes, I did. Yes, I did. Yes, I did. Yes, I, did. I, I, I have, have a great, have great, have great weekend. weekend. Did you? No, I didn't. No, I didn't. No, I didn't. No, I didn't. didn't. A movie. I saw a movie with my friends. I saw a movie with my, friend. movie with my friends. Okay, that's excellent. Now, let us repeat. Did you have a good weekend? Did you, you have a good, have a good weekend? weekend? Yes, I did. I had a great weekend. Yes, yes I, did. I did. I had a great, a great weekend. weekend. Did you stay at home? Did you stay did you home? Stay at home? No, I didn't. I saw a movie with my friends. No, I didn't. No, I, didn't. I, didn't. I, didn't. I didn't. I saw a movie with, with my friends. My friends. Okay. Well, with this exercise, we finished the section number four. Con esto terminamos la sección cuatro. So, tomorrow we will start section five. Vamos a empezar las cinco el día de mañana, si Dios permite. Espero que ya tengan completos sus ejercicios. La plataforma, section one, two, three. Interim exam and section four. Okay. 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 Nice. You've been doing a great job with simple past. Tomorrow we will study the simple past with the verb B. I hope you did a great job as you've been doing so far. So, see you tomorrow. See you, see you tomorrow. Good night. Good night. Good night, night. night teacher. Good night, Fernandez. Good night. 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 Good night.